I'm Peter LaFrance for BeerBasics.com, and this is Commentary. The Bunker Mentality. In June 2017, the Brewers Association launched their independent craft brewer seal. For over a year, it's been a topic of conversation between journalists, consumers, and those that read, write, talk, blog, and stream about beer. The Brewers Association has led the charge that the use of the word craft has been distorted beyond all recognition by most brewers in the United States. The marketing folks at AB InBev proudly announce that their Budweiser is actually a craft beer. I understand the importance of clear and precise interpretation of words, especially in the marketing of products that folks take great pride in producing. However, allow me to offer the observation that this incessant obsession with a particular word ignores the real stink that's in the room. A bunker mentality has begun to encroach into the collegial environment that has over half a century or so been associated with the folks that owned and ran small breweries in the United States. The use of the word bunker mentality evokes all sorts of images. Let me give you some more precise definitions. Merriam-Webster describes bunker mentality as a state of mind especially among members of a group that is characterized by chauvinistic defensiveness and self-righteous intolerance of criticism. American Heritage Dictionary defines it as an attitude of extreme defensiveness and self-justification based on an often exaggerated sense of being under persistent attack from others. And finally, Merriam-Webster describes the bunker mentality as the frightened feeling that you have when you think people are threatening or attacking you, which makes you want to avoid dealing with them. Brewers of beer, beware. This insidious mental state has taken root in the social and political fabric of this country. Polarization has been welded into our lives by an internet designed to illuminate, but has instead created a magnetic polarization rivaled only by the inherent polarization in the United States in the colonies just before the American Revolution. I offer this observation, that unless the beer brewing folks of this country take a good look at avoiding the bunker mentality, the results are inevitable. I'm Peter LaFrance for BeerBasics.com and this has been Cotton Jerry. I'm back to remind you that if you liked this video, please click on the thumbs up icon below. And while you're at it, Subscribe, and you will learn the next video goes hot just as soon as it does. I appreciate each and every subscription. I'm Peter LaFrance.